Hi, I'm Jidin. I'm the occupation therapist in an MC Provita. Now I'll be teaching you how to sit properly in a chair in front of the computer or a laptop. Uh, you can do stretching, strengthening and all that will be taught later. But first we have to change our environment. The where you're sitting, how you're sitting. Once you change this, you can get rid of a lot of things, a lot of pain, the shoulder, neck, the back and all pain can be reduced only when you change the environment. So here you can see my friend, he's sitting in a more of slouched position. So mostly people will think that this position will help them to reduce pain and all. But this is actually a very bad posture. So what you have to do is first, I'm going to ask you to turn, sit back and sit straight. If you have more space still on the back, you can actually keep a lumbar support like a small roll pillow or you can roll a, uh, any towel or something like that. You can keep it here so that his posture will come a little more front. Next, most of the people won't realize that the knee and the hip, which, which should be in very 90 degree position. So the hip should be exactly 90 degree and the knee also should be placed 90 degree, which he is not doing right now. I'm asking him to just raise the uh, seat level a little bit higher. Yes, not at high, lower, lower, okay, fine, keep it closer, okay, so this is the actual position which you can see, this is in the 90 degree hip and this one also is in the 90 degree. Second, if the leg is not reaching for certain people who are short, still what you can do is you can get foot stools. Food stools, you can get it from outside. You can keep it about how many inches you want. Make sure that your hip is 90 degree and the knee is in 90 degree. Next, next thing is, see most of the comfort chairs and all these type of chairs will have adjustable armrests. This is basically to keep your arms in a proper position so that no more, uh, there'll be very less weight or the stress comes on your spinal area or, or your trapezius area or this uh, area shoulder pain and all will reduce if your if your height of the armrest increases a little bit up you can see this so now he is basically resting the sh uh, shoulder on the armrest so that he can easily type not lower not too higher equal to the uh, nearly to the uh, around you can see how much it is little bit of abduction of shoulder and about 90 degree of bend okay so whenever you can see in the laptop on the bench you can keep the wrist so you should always rest the shoulder rest the elbow rest the uh, wrist then you can start typing next one more thing is that as you can see very clearly the he is looking more downwards so his neck will always be like this which will cause more strain for the neck. So always I prefer, if you adjust all this thing, if you can adjust the table a little more higher on his same eye level, that will be good. Otherwise, if it is difficult, if it is not able to, if you cannot able to change the height of the table, then what you can do is you can put some books or some other things so that the laptop or the, this thing higher height will come a little more higher so that the same in the eye level. So if you do these all things, you can actually prevent and you can have a better ergonomics while sitting in front of the computer. You will have less pain while going back to home. Thank you.